Good morning, Austin Mossfray. My name is Mr. Kleitz and I'm your assistant principal. I want to take this opportunity to welcome you back to school and we hope you have a great first day. Today is Monday, August 23rd, 2021. And my name is Ms. Verneau. I am your acting administrator. The weather for today is cloudy with a chance of meatballs. I mean, a chance of rain, Mr. Kleitz. No <laughs> meatballs today. The temperature is a high of 76 degrees Fahrenheit and a low of 72 degrees. And now for the lunch menu with Max. Humphreys West Elementary School menus. Lunch today is a roast con pollo, also known as rice with chicken, dinner roll, seasoned green peas, and fresh orange smiles. Breakfast tomorrow is French toast bites, turkey bacon, and fresh banana. Enjoy! See you again, Osprey. Just to remind you, my name is Mr. Kleitz, your assistant principal, and this is... Hi, I'm Ms. Furneaux. I'm the acting administrator. We are so happy to have you guys back in session. What an amazing morning this was. We hope you had a wonderful summer break. We hope you had lots of opportunities to learn, to play, to read, to sleep, to be with your family, whatever made you happy. We hope you had many opportunities to do those things. Now, we are so excited to get back in the, the role of school. Ms. Vernal, are you excited to be back in school? I'm excited, but I'm also a little bit nervous today. Why is that? Well, you know, the first day always makes me a little bit nervous, but I always bring something special with me. And today, I brought my favorite pencil. I've had this pencil for a really long time. And if you shake it, I got plenty of lead. It's going to be a great day with my favorite pencil. That is awesome. I wonder what makes our students, our boys and girls, happy on the first day of school. Maybe they have a favorite pencil too. Wow. So, boys and girls, when we come visit your room, could you tell us what makes you happy? Also, while we have you here, we want to review with you a couple of quick and very important things. Our first priority, Mrs. Vernos, mine, your teacher's first priority is to keep you safe. And in order to keep you safe, there are a few things we want to review with you. The first are things about COVID. You know it's what the world we live in right now. But in order to stay safe from COVID, we can do just a few simple things and do them well. First of all, we can always make sure we do what? Wash our hands. That's right, Ms. Verno. And if we can't wash our hands, what is the next thing we can do to keep our hands clean? Get that hand sanitizer out. Woo -woo. So there's hand sanitizer all over the school. You get it when you walk in the building. You get it when you go into your classrooms. You get it when you're going to the, to the cafeteria. So use that hand sanitizer. What's another thing that I can do, Ms. Verno? Oh, mind your wingspan. Oh, mind our wingspan. That's important because it will give space between you and your friends, and that will help you stay safe. I forgot the last thing. There's two, but I said there were three important things. What is that last important thing? You have it on your face, Mr. Clyde. Oh, this. Boys and girls, do you see my face mask? That's right. It's important that everybody, all the way from the smallest, youngest student to the assistant principal, we all need to wear our face mask. And we need to make sure that they cover our nose and our mouth and that they stay on at all times while we're inside. Is, is there a time that we can take them off though, Ms. Verno? Yeah, what? when you're eating lunch, when you need to take a drink of water, and when you go, when you get home, take it off then. Love it. So boys and girls, if you do those three things, you will be a safe osprey. There's other things that you know that we, that we want you to do. We want you to uh, walk in the hallways. We want you to be respectful to others. Mind your teacher's directions. Those are things that you all know and your teachers will get with you sooner. We will also be able to share a small presentation with you later on what we expect here at the school. Now I do want to say Miss Verno and I will come into each and every classroom and we will say hi to you. We'll see how your summer went and we will check in. However, when we come in your classroom, you know how you say hello? Is it, hi Miss Verno, Mr. Kleitz, it's good to see you. Let's not do it that way. Okay. Maybe there's a better way. I remember. Do you remember last year when we did the Osprey Wave? Oh, the Osprey Everyone Wave. Everyone practice the Osprey Wave. 
Oh, you're doing an awesome job. That means you're doing awesome. We love you. We hope you're having a great day. And we hope that you continue to do amazing things. All right? So anytime we see you in the hallway or the classroom, a quiet Osprey wave is all it takes. Thanks, boys and girls. We're so happy to have you. We hope that you have a great first day and a great school year. If we can ever do anything for you, you can stop us in and talk to us. We're happy to help. All right, boys and girls, and that's it for the Principal's Minute. And now for the Korean phrase of the week. <laughs> Bangapsumnida Bangapsumnida Nice to meet you Bangapsumnida And now let's get ready for the Pledge of Allegiance and with our school purpose statement. Let's do this together everybody. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and place your right hand over your heart. Ready? To the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Work together to develop characteristics and implement practices that produce enduring students, staff, and school excellence. Awesome Osprey Day! Osprey, lead the way!